All right, so we got Black Ops 6 Zombies gameplay intel drops. Good to be It feels there. like there's nothing else on the market that can scratch the itch that okay. Black Ops 6 Zombies gives. It's just so fun to play through that gameplay loop over and over again. Uh-oh. Okay, wait, we got, some, we got some information. One of the newest things we have is called Augments, and it's the new way for us to upgrade perks, ammo mods, and field upgrades. Wait. We'll give you three major augments and three minor augments for you to choose from. So a major augment could would be more drastic. So there's a major augment that will turn into three orbs that will essentially carousel around you and protect you. So it's like a, it's like a force field. Stat changes like this napalm burst will now deal slightly more damage. One of our brand new perks, Melee Macchiato, gives you a devastating punch melee. It has a major augment that will improve the melee attack speed for all of your melee weapons. I know perks have ah. been in every game, but the augments really do give a new breadth to perks and using them, adding that customizability to using perks, making it feel individual to the one who's using it. So no perk really feels the same between two players. Augments are a game changer. They allow you so much control over the way An you want to play augment, huh? In the game. Now we have replaced the armor upgrades in the arsenal with ammo mods. So when you go to the arsenal, you can apply an ammo mod to your weapon and upgrade its rarity. We are bringing Balwagos back and really just looked at how we could find <laughs> it and improve it for Black Ops 6. So you will be able to pick five gobble gums in the menus and put those into a pack that you then use inside the match. And in the match, you just find a gumball machine, you go up to it, and then it'll give you one of those gobble gums. And you can choose when you want to activate them, and you yeah. can activate multiple at once. They can range from small changes in gameplay to drastic changes in upgrades that can really benefit a player. They can give you- Oh, really? or even allow you to fire a weapon without using up any ammunition. They can be really powerful when used in a timely manner. Oh like yeah, oh yeah. Great. They this might be the best zombies in years, I'm gonna be honest build, with you. Which includes attachments and blueprints on a weapon. Players to then set that as a zombie build. That means when you're playing a match and you access a weapon via a wall buy or a mystery box, you'll get that zombie build in the game. It's at its core a mode that we love. Wait, I just saw bottom left. I just saw a plate. New directions to keep it fresh and exciting, but at the same time, making sure it's delivering on all the big elements that are core to the DNA of the Oh, bro, that Omni move is going to hit crazy. New experiences. That Omni move is going to hit absolutely insane. Oh, we got a COD next. All right, man, we can pre order right now, man. We got a Call of Duty next at uh, August 28th. Now, to be honest with you, I did see like in a gameplay, I saw like in a like in a screenshot, or whatever. I did see that like we're gonna have like plates whenever it comes to zombies. To be honest with you, I mean I don't mind that or whatever. Like it's not like a uh so like if you look bottom left or whatever, you see like um like 150 HP, or whatever, you'll see like the like the blue tab. That usually means like plates. And obviously you can see like um like the three plates right there. And you can see like a like a revive next to it as well. I can't lie to you, bro. I'm loving this. And bro, look at the font. Look at the font right here. But this is this is like OG Call of Duty Black Ops like font for like zombies. It's crazy, man. So to be honest with you, man, I'm really excited about this. Um, we got a Call of Duty next. I'm gonna be honest with you. Whenever it comes to like Call of Duty Nexus, I'm gonna keep it just straight cope aesthetically honest with you. I usually okay. I would like check it out. I, I would like dab it out. But to be honest with you, I I, I really don't wanna like I really don't wanna like, you know like watch a lot of gameplay i don't want i don't want to like spoil myself because to be honest with you bro um a lot of these streamers a lot of these uh you know youtuber streamers whatever obviously you know they're going to get their content whatever they're going to stream for like you know their audience or whatever uh which is always good you know they're going to test play the game whatever but to be honest bro I, bro i've been playing call of duty for so long it's crazy so um whenever the game like whenever the beta comes out i think the beta was going to come out um in september i think like the first week or second week of uh september so i'm going to be pretty excited to play the, uh to play the beta so um i will tune in i'll dab in some streams or whatever you know just to see what's going on but uh until that beta comes through in like september 11th or like 13th or whatever i kind of forget the date but i know it's like early september um until that beta comes through bro I i'm gonna try to lean off some of the gameplays uh it, and i don't bro listen 
usually i'm not like that usually bro i'm all for like securing the gameplay or whatever but here's what i'll say though if we get like a 45 minute gameplay like zombies gameplay whatever bro we're watching it i can't lie to you we're, like we're watching it we're gonna dissect everything but that might be a two hour video i can't lie to you so you know listen we'll see we'll, we'll see what happens but uh so far man I, i'm liking everything that i'm seeing they add in the thing is you know what i like I like that they're not overwhelmed. Like I like that it's it's like standard zombies, and that they're not adding in too much of, of of like. I mean, they can add in like their new stuff, bro. It's their game. They can add in whatever they want, but it's not overwhelming, bro. Like they're adding in like some new things. They obviously they gave us like a new map or whatever, but like it it number one, it looks good. Number two, it's it's standard. Like we're not you know, uh, could, like we're not you know buying jetpacks and flying all over the map you know to shoot zombies on the floor like we're not it's very standard i like that a lot it's standard zombies i think we all miss that um it, i like how how regular it looks I, I like i don't i don't like i'm gonna be honest with you like the, like the modern warfare 3 zombies like i think you're like uh fighting zombies all over like the original map or like Bro, we had to travel to egypt just to like get the mystery box like all that stuff i'm gonna be honest with you bro it, it was uh this one right here, bro, this seems, it, it gives back, like, Black Ops 2 vibes, bro. It, it's very, like, standard, and I love that. I can just tell, I haven't even played it yet, but I could just tell, bro, it looks standard. It looks very just co aesthetic. I'm digging this one. I can't lie. I got a lot of faith in the zombies. Now, uh, whenever it comes to the multiplayer, obviously, I'm going to check out gameplay for that, but I'm going to be real, bro. Uh, and to, again, until that beta comes out, you know, I, until I get hands-on experience for it, um, you know, we, we fully really won't know, uh, what, like, multiplayer size. But um, And then campaign. Let's not forget about the campaign now. The campaign, bro, I'm going to be all over the campaign, bro. Let, let, let's just keep it real. So the campaign is most likely going to come later, like, you know, near or not even near, but just on the release date, whatever. Um, but right now, I'm really focused on the multiplayer and zombies. So uh, whenever it comes to Call of Duty next, we're going to check it out. We're going to see how it is. But um, to be honest with you, bro, I'm just ready for that Black Ops 6. And, um, man, comment down below, man. What do you guys think about this Intel drop from Call of Duty? So you guys got to mix them out. And...